Detroit. This city's NBA team has dropped the ball, leaving them at the bottom of the Eastern Conference. And that can be very frustrating because their conference isn't all that. Now, everybody knows LaMelo's been in Detroit training. This city once was a booming economy, now is only a shadow of its former self. But there are still residents there that have pride in their city and want to see it restored to glory. That's where Melo comes in. This ball, ball, ball brother is blazing. His family are definitely trailblazers and it feels like he's already a vet because we've watched him so long. Now the new MB1 logo from Puma, he put it on display first in their city. Now I've had some credible rumors told to me, but I didn't want to say a thing about it until I saw this. So do you have any idea in regards to the draft where he's going to be going to? Can you, know you give what? a little bit of a hint, a you, tiny you, bit? You, 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 you Ball Facts family, brace yourself. I have heard that the Detroit Pistons now believe in LaVar's dream because Jermaine Jackson was that good of a spokesperson and said he knows firsthand it will work out. Now I know I usually give you the facts, but there were so many juicy supporting facts to not bring you this rumor. I had to bring you this type of video. Let me know if you like this and you want more in the future. If you hate it, you'll get over it. Now let's get back to this credible source that told me this information about a month ago that I refused to put out because I didn't believe it at first. He said that, there were two main objectives for the Detroit Pistons. The first one was to make sure that LaMelo Ball would be a good fit for their team. And after talking with JJ, they decided he would be a good fit. The second objective was to make sure that LaMelo would be happy there. You know, NBA players leave teams all the time. So in order to secure him there, they are looking at Lonzo. He only has one year left at the Pelicans. And they are looking at giving G3 a shot as well. They have the seventh pick this year and players that they are looking at and willing to trade in order to get that number one pick from the Minnesota Timberwolves. That's what I heard, guys. Now, usually when LeVar is asked where does he want one of his sons to go play, he usually, his first response is where there's a coach that will play him. Whenever he had talked to Rob Palenka and Magic, he was saying all my boys on the Lakers because he had a conversation with Magic. He was only saying New York for a while because it's a big market and not a lot of stars. Now he throws in Detroit all of a sudden? Come on, guys. Now you take it or leave it if you think this rumor is true or not. Go ahead, go to shopballfacts.com to get your Ball Facts hoodie. Like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Ball Facts again.